Hey guys, I'm just going to demonstrate to you an installation of a Naval 3 in an MG ZT260. This unit was originally bought for my E46, so it had the E46 wiring loop, but that can be quite easily used on a premium setup ZT. This originally had in it the Harman Kardon system with the Mark III sat nav system. So it had all of the Siemens products installed in the boot. So all you have to do, take out your main amp, just to make it easy. Your original cable for extension of a premium system in a BMW it comes with the squares and the round on a lead, five meter trail lead. You just plug that into the back here. Route your cable through or around. It's not in at the moment, it's just temporary there to show you a demonstration. Please ignore the fact that the inside's out, I'm doing all the work, you do not have to take it this far. You can see down there there is a nice cable duct down running down the passenger side. You can run it down there straight up to the front with ease. Have the unit there. I can turn the ignition on. And the unit will boot. There is no modifications to get the steering controls to work. It will work straight out of the box with the BMW connections. All you have to do is splice the illumination wire, which is here. You can just chop that from the BMW box and connect it to the illumination circuit, which is already up in the front. And that will make it work fine for you. Demonstration of steering wheel controls. We'll turn it on. This will be using the original HK crossover unit, which is installed in the car, um, which used to be driven by the BMW amplifier, um, which will now be driven directly from the head unit in here. The power output of the Navel is much, much better than the BMW unit. So sound clarity is greatly improved. Subwoofer response in the boot is greatly improved. You no longer have issues with uh, farting, distortion, etc. out of the base. This unit does come with DAB as it shows there. I'm going to demonstrate it using the disc player. Just put you on the CD. So, now that's a fully working system. Steering wheel controls, no modifications, working, changing track, changing modes, changing sounds, no problem. There will be other photographs going up on the forums to show you the installation, how simple it can be made, um, and keeping the integrity of your premium system. Thanks.